So Dave, the guys got all the insulation down, they're right. kicking out sheet. So, I mean, they're smoking right up this roof. Yeah, they are. You'll notice, the guys on this last sheet here, they got the magnets laid out. All they're really doing right now is welding these plates along the sink. Correct. So what does that let them do? That lets them run the robot then. Exactly. Yep. So you don't have to weld every every seam on every sheet that yep. instant, okay? You want to get it just enough in to hold it down so it's not going anywhere. So the main purpose of running that robot, what does it make this roof do? It makes it watertight. You get dried in quicker. Yes. So that's kind of the brush. It. I see guys do this all the time. They'll kick a sheet out. Now they've got guys welding every plate. Yeah, no. Then they wait yeah. to run the next sheet. Yeah. So as you can see, this is exactly what these guys are doing. It's kind of the correct way to run Rhino Bond to make it more productive. Kick a sheet out, weld along the seam with your Rhino Bond machine. That allows you to fire that robot up. It's dried in quicker. You get more roof coverage and you just leapfrog up the roof. Now, when they get to a certain point, they're probably going to drop a couple guys back with Rhino Bond machines. And catch up. And catch all these plates they missed. Right. So again, that's the advantage of the Rhino Bond system.